Hey YouTube, welcome back. So, um, I'd just like to share my how I fuse cacters with my knock simulator and quickly go over a little um tutorial for it. Not really a tutorial. Well, I guess it is a tutorial. I don't know what it is. But um I'll have the link to my macro in the description down below. I'll probably be linking to GitHub. We should be able to copy and paste it pretty easily. And um, I'm just going to show you how the macro works and what you're going to need to do for it. And in addition to the macro, um, for anyone that doesn't already know, um, this will also like show you how to fuse cacters in general. So anyway, the first thing I'm going to do is go to the Enhance Units and go to Fusion Cell Units. And then I'm going to sort my filter up in the top right corner there, just sort filter. And then I'm going to click on Level and Level Ascending. So this is considered the first sort level ascending filter i'm gonna do four stars right now you can do the exact same thing with three stars you just click on three stars here i only do one at a time because it's much, it's much better uh, for this macro in particular and then we're gonna also filter by unit level and we're gonna do non-max so that will make all the characters that you own display in this tab great right perfect so in addition to that um what you want to do is you want to take a level one character and then enhance a higher level character into that one. So I probably don't have one to show right now, but uh, yeah, I do. So yeah, this max level one here, we want to get rid of that. So this is called the second sort. I have the notes in the left side if anyone needs to reference it, but I'm going to go sort, uh, what was that called? Sort filter again. And we're going to filter by four stars, non max to get rid of that max character. We don't want to waste that one. Then we're going to do level and descending. So now we'll display the highest level character first, and it'll be the non-max one. So we'll just fuse one into that, that guy. We'll fuse him. And then success. Now the reason why we do one at a time is because this has a chance to be like a greater success rate and give you more experience back. Which may be even more handy in the future. Because we might get like success rate ups and stuff. So I'm going to click change base here. You don't need to. But for the macro, it is changing the base for several reasons. I forget the actual reasons why we did that. But there were reasons that made it work better with the base. So I'm just going to play the macro here and let it run through so you guys can see it working. Um, I'll also have it named in a file for you. So yeah, the macro is just going to go through and do all that manually so you can get the most efficient way to use your characters. Um, uh, I would say one thing. When the character gets through in the level 55 to 58 range, there's a chance that if you keep letting the macro run while you're away from your computer, there's a chance that if you get a rate up, it will waste some experience on your character. But overall, this is like way easier than doing it manually. Um, this is for Nox 720 version. It's like 720 by, I forget the actual settings. Let me look it up for you. But um, it is, um, it is set for a specific size in your Knox simulator and it's for Knox only. Um, if you guys got any trouble of actually importing macros in the Knox, let me know and I'll do like a quick tutorial on how to use uh, macros on Knox in general. And I can even like show you guys how to rename them properly so that you don't have like a mess of files there and you can actually reference them. Um, let me just find the sizes for this macro right quick. I'll just say it. Um, the sizes are do, 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 720 times 1080 so i'll write that in the notes as well so here we have some notes here um nox emulator 720 by 10 1280 so if you're afk um when it gets to the level 55 58 range if you get like a success rate a huge one you will waste some experience um other than that you don't really need to worry about it you're getting like a lot of experience back look i just got a great success so fusing one at a time is super efficient and I, basically, I just let this run and I just walk away for a little bit and do other things. Or watch a stream or watch some YouTube. Like, I, I, I would never be able to do this one by one in my own time. That would be very painful. So, yeah, I think it's pretty good. Um, like I said, I'll put a link to the description. I'll probably link to GitHub. And uh, here's some notes on the side for you. So, we got the first sort, just to reiterate. Um, you'll want to sort by non-max, level ascending, three stars, or four stars, depending on which ones you're fusing. 
Then from the second sort, we're going to do non-max level descending. You want to fuse a low level, or uh, you want to fuse a high level character into a low level one, and then match the same sort as the first one. I mean, you could like play around with the threes and four stars, but I find this to be the most efficient. And um, yeah, the knock simulator size, 720 by 1080. Unfortunately, I don't use Mimu. Um, if I get a lot of Mimu requests, maybe I can, but for now I just use Nox. And I'll also leave a link to the uh, emulator in the description as well. So I'll, 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 write, I'll write that down on my notes too. I'll leave a link to the emulator and macro in the description. So yeah, um, that's basically it. Just wanted to do a quick video on that. I will put a, a video of Esther versus Scorn of the Beast tomorrow. I had to figure out a couple things with my team comp because I don't have Foca to do it like super, super fast. So there's that. But we'll figure it out. I'll make this a little bit bigger. And yeah, thanks for subscribing. Or thanks for subscribing. I'm sorry. Thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe. All right. Thanks. Thanks, everyone. And um, I'll see you guys in the next video. I'm just going to leave my macro running here and uh, yeah, peace out YouTube. Thanks for hanging out.